Thanks for playing the Super Boomer Maker 2 game! Last time we showed you features of the game and you gave lots of great new ideas, so let's a go! Since boomers are bad drivers, the Koopa in the car is no exception. He's so old that when he sees you, he accidentally puts it in reverse. Boomer Spike is a little too weak to hold his own spike ball, so now when he pukes it up, it just falls directly on him. Since boomers don't quite have the oomph that they used to, the boomer cannon box is the same. Instead of shooting a really strong bullet, it just plops out and rolls a bit. Bowser is such a boomer, he has a terrible memory and can't remember why he hates you. So when you approach him, he just stands there. You can pass right by him with no issue. But if you kill him with the axe, you get arrested for elder abuse. Now coin values are adjusted for inflation from a boomer's childhood, so a 50 coin in the game now is worth about 3 coins from back then. Now the wiggler becomes an angry wiggler not by jumping on it, but by being on the grass nearby since boomers hate when you walk on their lawn. Now story mode is just an old boomer Mario telling stories of what it was like back in his day of running through levels before he had all the new fancy schmancy level gadgets. Even brick blocks are weak like boomers, just walking across them causes them to break. This game uses boomer lingo from back in their childhood days. Like now, Hot Courses is called The Bee's Knees. Instead of booing and harding a level, you give it a I don't fancy it. And I think it's swell. When Mario beats a level, instead of saying Mario number one, he says Hot diggity dog, Mario's the cat's pajamas. Now you can't blame little Timmy if you see a snake block wandering around aimlessly, it's just blind like a boomer. And now it's your turn again. Comment below some more ideas that will make the game more like a boomer and it might be featured in a future video.